44% as of January this year. On investment, over the past 10 years, Thailand has not invested enough in the transportation and logistic projects, relying heavily on road, road mode transportation has led to a higher cost for your business and this has made Thailand less competitive in comparison to other countries. To address this, my government is investing infrastructure projects in all areas, including land, air and sea transportation. This project will create better linkage with neighboring countries, creating new opportunities and generate revenue from increased cross-border trade. Because right now, the number of the trading in the border area also increased every year, especially uh, last year also. So, this will be a firm our position as a logistic hub and gateway to ASEAN communities, as well as create new hubs and cities in all areas in Thailand. As you have seen in the past, how, how our investment plans have already been disrupted by political issues and change in government. So, to be ensure that this will not happen again, these investment plans will be submitted as a law to Parliament. This means that 49 billion euros investment in high-speed train and dual track, road network, deep sea port, or mass transit line will be implemented over the next seven years, regardless of the change, any change in the government. So this is will be another way to ensure you that all the investment will allocate and will be based on the strategy and improve the Thailand competitiveness. So I would like to invite German company with the expertise in infrastructure to invest in our futures. Meanwhile, 9 billion euro will be invested in water resource management to keep the regional supply chains and your investment safe from flood. So will be the case, the learning case in the past of the flooding will be the expert enough so we won't let this case reoccur again. So that's why government enough clear on the uh, investment of the water resource management. So now we are reviewing the process, uh, proposal to the detailed and transparent international bidding process and we should be able to implement this project before the end of the year. To, in order to support and expand your market in the future, our leadership in regional connectivities add values to your investment and expand the market for your products. This will be reinforced through trade agreements. In the Asia Pacific, we are developing regional competency economy partnerships that will support existing free trade agreements among the ASEAN communities and the six key trading partners including China, Japan, South Korea, Australia, New Zealand, and India. With regard to the EU, I am pleased to have launched Thai-EU FTA negotiations and finalized the Thai-EU Partnership Cooperation Agreement on PCA during my visit to the EU earlier this month. So once in force, this should be further boost our trade and investment. While this agreement support our growth, we will need to ensure that our growth will be sustainable and green. This is an area where we could use German investment and technology to develop green technologies. I have discussed with Chancellor Merkel and we agreed to develop a strategic dialogue on environmental issues to enhance energy efficiencies promote alternative energies and also green technologies. So we believe that will be some of you who are experts in this area. So this is 
another area that we will come more of the uh, wisdom. So to complement this T2T effort, we would like to work with you, with all of you in this area, in particular technologies for construction of building and infrastructure that fairly to the environment. We believe that uh, if we working harder and also cooperation very uh, solid, so I think all the projects or the investment and build the partnership between Thailand and Thai and Germany. On top of this, we will ensure that Thailand continue to be a nice place for you and your family to live and, and to do the business here. I believe that the unique hospitalities of Thai people with smiley and friendly face, our rich cultures and grateful hope they are uh, sad that this lunch doesn't have the Thai food. <laughs> I hope you can find a nice Thai restaurant to feel the great food will be provided with your support and for the successful of the investment here in Thailand. So that's why we encourage you to visit some time in Thailand and see uh, the location of the best place to stay with your family in some time. Once again, I would like to thank for the confidence and support that you have given Thailand to Thailand in the both good and difficult times. Really to say thank you again for coming to Thailand. My government will continue to support your investment in order to further strengthen the partnership between Thailand and Germany. Looking forward to working with you. Thank you very much.